What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings TNT, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current karmic energy. For the collective, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings. I appreciate you guys for all of the love and the support you show to me in the channel. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. All right, let's see what's going on with the collective. Beauty spells. So somebody could be doing some kind of spell on you to get for you to get them to, for you to like them. This could be the same sex for somebody. All right, this could be a psycho that really wants you. I'm hearing for somebody, this could be somebody you work with. Okay, this is a psycho motherfucker, yo. This person, like, this person obsessively wants you. And they could be tag teaming, seeking assistance to up the hate because you don't want them. For some of y'all, I'm hearing this is a person you work with. For others of you, I'm hearing this could be in the same community. Okay, you could live around this person. Okay, for some of y'all, this person was trying to trick you into like they wanted you or something like that is what I'm getting. Okay, yeah, I split the deck on this Queen of Pentacles. Okay, this person that has a storm coming their way. All right. Y'all. <laughs> Let's see. What's going on with this energy? Beauty spells, bisexual, psycho, and hate. Okay, what's going on, spirit? What's going on? Queen of Pentacles. Okay, <clears throat> so somebody could be upset. King of Pentacles, okay? As you can see, this King of Pentacles is upset. All right, this person even look like they got their fist balled up right there, okay? So, what I'm seeing is, this could be a couple. Somebody could be mad at their wife, okay? Somebody could be mad because they could have found out that their wife liked the same sex or something like that, okay? Somebody could have, somebody could have, Somebody husband could have found out that they wife or they girlfriend like the same sex. And whoever this person is that this wife or this girlfriend could be dealing with, this person is psycho as hell. Okay? Yeah, somebody could have been lying about what they be doing at nighttime or something like that with somebody. Or this could be a queen of pentacles energy that could be upset and found out, you know, that they husband or they boyfriend, you know, like the same sex. Or this could be some kind of this could be a person in your community that could be upset and this person wants you tied to them, okay? This person that, that like you or something like that, okay? If you're not married or if you ain't with nobody, this could just be somebody in your community, somebody you work with, okay? Yeah, this, this, this person's psycho as hell. Okay, let's keep going. All right, Wheel of Fortune. So this is a faded event. I feel like it's a lot of things about to change here. Okay, and a connection. Yeah, we got justice here. But it's a cause and effect in the situation. All right, let's see. Knight of Swords. And we have the fool, okay? And then we got this queen of pentacles here, all right? So what I'm seeing is somebody could be in a situation where, because remember I said a couple different, you know, situations 
So only take what resonates with you, okay? But one of them, you know, is there is a person that really wants you. And this person is trying to do some kind of spells to get you to want them. This person could be upset because it's something that they didn't see coming here. Yeah, something totally ended. Okay, this person could have felt like that they was going to be able to convince you to be with them. Okay, if this is that, if you're not in a relationship or married or nothing like that, this could just be that kind of person. Okay. And if you are in a relationship or this could be somebody in a relationship, man or woman, somebody is about to find out that somebody like the same sex and whoever is, um, whoever this third party is, this person is crazy as hell. Okay. And this could have been a situation where somebody was trying to keep this on a hush hush. If this is somebody in a relationship, somebody was trying to keep this on a hush hush, but whoever this third party is, they getting tired of being like a secret. They getting tired of being like, you know, on the side and stuff like that. Okay. And this person is getting real pissed off. Okay. Is what is also what I'm hearing and seeing. Yep. And this person could be about to come after somebody's uh person. All right. Like, you know, this could be some kind of crazy ass shit like that. Okay. So we got double Virgo, Aquarius, Aries, Libra, okay? Double Libra out here too, okay? So yeah, this could be, you know, something like that. All right, let's clarify this Queen of Pentacles spirit. Let's clarify this Queen of Pentacles. All right, so we got the Hangman, the Ten of Wands, and the high priestess and we have the seven of cups so yeah i feel like that if this is like a single situation i feel like this person could be uh whatever this person could be very spiritual or something like that or this person could be really hiding that they trying to get you to look at them in a different light okay this person like i said they doing like beauty spells so this person could be trying to like make you like them or make you look at them in a different light or something like that okay because this person is trying to figure out how to come towards you to present you something okay because for some people if this is like a single person if you single this person could be trying to really like figure you out okay for some of y'all this person don't know if you like the same sex or not so they trying to figure that out okay but this person is trying to figure out a way to come towards you though okay yeah this person trying to figure out how to come towards you they don't know really what to do okay for some of y'all this person could feel like that you are in a, um, another connection too so this person is like looking at your life you know like for some of y'all this is a person you work with they always like have conversation with you or something like that like this person always trying to start a conversation with you because this person is trying to know who you are for some of y'all this could be your boss that you work with okay this person is very interested in you okay like on another level all right clarify king of swords clarify king of swords three of pentacles okay if this is like a relationship okay kind of situation this could be a situation where somebody could have seen something on a platform and this pissed somebody off, nine of swords. Somebody could have seen something that somebody could have posted when it came to the uh, same sex situation. All right. Somebody could have seen somebody post something on like a platform. Okay. And they got upset about it. This could be same sex energy okay clarify will of fortune clarify will of fortune queen of swords and we got knight of swords yeah i feel like when somebody spoke some truth it could have changed everything 
somebody could have found out um somebody could have spoke some truth but i'm i'm hearing that this could have been a third party that came in strong to tell on somebody okay about what's really going on and shit like that but i feel like that somebody else already knew okay their intuition somebody intuition been telling them about they mate okay if this is like a relationship kind of situation but i feel like somebody gonna get some kind of information like it's gonna be shocking and everything and then i feel like that somebody gonna start digging even more to try to find more information to try to see like damn is this really true and then i feel like that somebody is going to confront somebody with the information but i feel like somebody is going to admit what's what okay like somebody is gonna admit it all right but they gonna have to be confronted first though okay like this person is not just gonna come out and say shit. they gonna get caught up but this person will admit like yeah you know clarify justice clarify justice horrified in the reverse star card in the reverse five of cups yep when somebody figured when this come out okay this is gonna cause a breakup because somebody is not gonna agree with what somebody is doing or whatever um somebody is gonna lose complete hope in the whole situation uh, somebody is going to be very sad, but somebody is going to go forward, you know, in a situation. Somebody going to be very sad. Yep. Somebody going to be sad. And somebody is going to be upset like, man, why did you... You know, I wanted to tell this person on my own time or whatever this is, but... Somebody third party is about to expose somebody because somebody is tired of being a damn secret is what I'm hearing. Okay, if this is a relationship, somebody is about to find out about some shit here. Knight of Swords, clarify Knight of Swords. Queen of Wands in the reverse. Page of Swords. Yep, because I'm feeling like this third party is in this Queen of Wands in reverse energy. This person could be very like vengeful. Yeah, this person could be very vengeful, like, feeling like, nah, fuck that. You know, I'm going to do what I'm going to do. Okay? That's what I'm seeing here. So, yeah, this person is, is going to expose some information here. Clarify the fool. Clarify the fool. And if you are single, if this is like a single thing, for some of y'all, this person is going to figure out that you're not interested or something like that because you're going to speak some kind of truth. But I feel like after somebody speaks some kind of truth about not being interested or whatever this is, somebody going to get very vengeful. They're going to be very, um, they're not going to take rejection very easy. Okay. That's what I'm seeing here. Clarify the fool. Clarify the fool. queen of cups and we have the chariot yeah because i feel like if this is a relationship thing i feel like that somebody if this is like a third party kind of situation here where somebody is hiding this i feel like that when someone finds this out they're gonna set themselves free and somebody is gonna completely like possibly move out the state somebody is gonna completely like move away like all the way away like, not just move out the house. Like, somebody gonna move out the fucking state when they find out this info. Okay? And then, if this is, like, a single thing, okay, um, where, you know, maybe this is somebody you work with, you know, somebody in your community, I feel like that this person is gonna take a risk to try to come towards you. Okay? Some kind of way. But I feel like that for some of you guys... Like, you're going to tell this person that, you know, you it's something you're going to decline with them. Is You're going to decline it, whether you don't go that way or you're in a relationship or you're just not interested. It's going to be something like where you're, you know, you say something like that. This person is not going to like that. 
this person like they don't take rejection very easy okay like they don't you know and you wouldn't even think that this person would be on that kind of time with you you know because it's like motherfucker i don't even know you like that or something like that but this person is like you know they're not used to getting rejected so you rejecting them is like what and for some of y'all this person been sitting back and studying you trying to figure out how to come towards you so they can so they know that they will get a for sure yes from you like this person don't want to be rejected so when this person come towards you they gonna feel like that they got you kind of like planned out and for some of y'all you are gonna you know politely you're gonna be firm you're gonna speak the truth but you gonna you gonna do it in a way where it's like it's not gonna be like you know um like i mean it's gonna be straightforward you know it's gonna be straightforward all right and if this is like a couple thing i'm seeing that when this third party come towards this wife or girlfriend and expose the information okay i feel like then somebody gonna try to dump the third party and try to keep they mate and that's when it's gonna be a whole big blow up in a situation because somebody is gonna set gonna like diss the third party and be like well no i want to keep my my marriage or i want to keep my relationship and then the third party gonna start going crazy and shit okay so only take what resonate with you okay so we got virgo we got libra like i said aquarius aries cancer strong cancer taurus okay strong taurus is out here okay yeah that's what i'm seeing here all right yeah 35 somebody could be 35 i feel like that whatever you do for work okay for some of y'all whatever you do for work you at the top of the top whatever you do for work i feel like when you come to work it's like people be looking for your ass to come to work because you always get shit right all right 35 34 okay like you you the big dog when it comes to you know whatever you do for work motherfuckers be looking for you okay but yeah that's what i'm seeing here yep this person psycho and when they say teaming up to assist with hate this is giving me that's why i say somebody gonna deny somebody because it's like you know it's like then somebody gonna start you know getting crazy and shit because they not gonna like you know being rejected okay i'm hearing secretary okay secretary some with dark dark brown hair okay Alright, cotton panties, that water sign of hater, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So this is giving me like a love-hate kind of energy. I'm going to be real. Somebody that love you, they want to fuck with you, but it's like <laughs> they hate you at the same time. It's a love and hate kind of thing. Yep. That earth sign is a hater. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody loves Starbucks. Somebody could love cooking. All right, we got a coffee. Somebody could be a cashier. All right, somebody could drive a foreign or someone could be foreign. We have neck tattoos. All right, we have Gemini. All right, somebody could be in their 30s. Somebody could have dimples. All right, we have 50s. Somebody could love gym shoes. 
We have sleeve tattoo, thick eyebrows. All right, somebody could be middle class. Carmax or chapsticks. Somebody love wearing black socks. We have widow. High cheekbones. Okay, we have sports. We have X con Long eyelashes. Somebody love wearing ponytails. We have Spanish. An incubus energy. Cats. We have African. Mechanic. 40s. Doctor. Aquarius. You fell all on the floor, Aquarius. What the hell? <laughs> Colorful socks. Wine. RV. Dark hair. All right, that water sign, a hater. And then we have boy shorts. Yep, so that's what I'm seeing, y'all. Get some initials. I'm gonna let y'all go. I'm hearing um uh, Mariah. I'm hearing Mariah. Okay, I'm hearing Valencia too. All right. I'm hearing Howard. Okay. Okay, we got Capricorn. All right, we got Pisces. Somebody could be 31. Somebody could have a 13-year-old. Okay. I'm hearing Sydney, Sigma. All right. Something with Gemini. Somebody could have two R's in their name. All right. We have Virgo. Somebody could be a double Virgo or somebody could have been born in 99. Aries. Somebody's name could be Wright right like somebody named to be right okay okay 46 49 41 43 96 93 91 94 39 36 31 34 41 43 46 and 49 something with irish irish Okay. Something with Samira. Somebody could have two G's in their name. Two G's. Okay. spirit I'm hearing Rashad something with Rashad all right something with Rashad all right you guys I'm gonna leave it there like comment and subscribe look in the description box below for any other information about me and until next time peace